Hey, hey everybody, this is Erica from the Classic Glam Blog coming to you today about uh, the Oklahoma fraternity video. It's sad, it's ridiculous, we all know. Um, but the best part I can ever tell somebody is work for yourself. Uh, do not get up and go work for these guys because when they leave college, if no one hires them, they're starting businesses. They're going to be okay. Their parents are going to make sure that they succeed out of all this mess they created. Be smarter than that. You know, I mean, read Money, uh, Mr. Money Mustache. Seven years you can retire, depending on your strategy. I'm telling you, start your side hustle today. Start your your side business. Get out of get out of the freaking cubicles. Get out of the offices that you hate. Pay down whatever debt you need to. Get free. The, those guys. What they said, they felt it. They thought it was funny enough to chant it. We can all go, they're young. Da, da. No, these are adults. They're in college. Trust me. These guys are getting jobs. And these guys are going to run someone's business. Or their own. So, at this point, i rather depend and, depend and fail on my own measure. If I'm going to start a side company, I'm going to go out and I'm going to browse clients and prospect. I'm going to be successful whether I'm black or, or whether someone sees me as a woman regardless because why i'm not dependent on someone to give me a paycheck or dependent to come to an office and be nice so that i can keep my job that's that's part of the reason i became a real estate agent so that i could work with whatever clients were willing to work with me and get them the best deal possible you cannot depend on others for your paycheck it's this economy it doesn't work that way and that's why so many immigrants come here and they are so successful because guess what they are not playing they come here and they don't want to work for other people either they come here they buy gas stations in poor neighborhoods they buy houses wherever they can and they get going they build their assets that's why 48 percent of the hotels in the united states are owned by indian citizens they're in, they're americans uh but of indian origin from india and and, and people go how did it happen in, in such a short time period because they did not come here to play they did not come here to buy rims and cars and go out and party every weekend. They came to handle their business. And so when I see this video, I promise you, these kids are going to leave here, leave Oklahoma, you know, move to a different city, move to Texas, move to, you know, East Coast, whatever, and, and start anew and just be just fine. And if someone ever finds out they were on this video, oh, well, oh, it was because I was young. And they're going to keep it moving. And that's the most frustrating part that you're doing your child a disservice by sending them out hoping they get a job with somebody like that guy and think that guy is gonna care about them or help promote them or be a good manager. No, come to your job, have your exit strategy already. Just go ahead if you got to for six, seven, eight, nine months, just be stacking cash in a monthly uh, dividend stocks, uh, you know, get you a house, rent your rooms out in your house, or if you already got a family, get you a duplex or a fourplex. Move your family in there for the first three, three to three to four years, or two to four. You got some flexibility there, depending on how young your children are. Do not be at the mercy of these type of people. And sadly, I think they're all over the United States. Not as worse as I would say 1950s, 1960s, but I would say you still have hot pockets of people who are like, oh, like I don't have anything against black people, but I won't be around them and I won't hire them for any of my jobs or companies you know don't be at the mercy of these type of people get your own business get out there i have programs on my website i have a list of books i've read that i would want to give to you you know the list freely so that you can get out of the crutch of being underneath some people like this so again this is erica from the classy clown blog reach me at erica s williams on twitter wow uh, good luck out there uh, have a great day, folks.